Five Star Property Management, video tour of the property located at 470 Walnut Street in San Bruno, California. This is a three bedroom, two bath, a single family home, a little bit over 1,000 square feet. We're gonna give you a very detailed walkthrough tour of the property to save you some time, money, energy, and effort. Uh, and if you do decide that this is a property you would like to see in person, we definitely encourage you to come and attend one of our upcoming open houses. So immediately the first thing you notice here in this uh, main living area is a nice, highly polished inlaid wood floor. Very nice detail. You also have a very nice formal dining area beyond this space. You've got a nice skylight in here to let some natural light in. The dimensions for all these rooms, as well as the rooms that we're gonna see in a little bit, are on our website. That is located at go5starpm.com. Again, go5starpm.com. Definitely encourage you, to go, encourage you to go take a look at the website. We have high quality photographs, dimensions, link to the online application, qualification criteria, and anything else you might wanna know about this property. I wanna point out the thermostat right there. There is central heating at this property. We've got this cool little um, the breakfast bar area, pass through area for the kitchen so that if you're passing items back and forth and maybe having a fancy dinner, you can pass items through the kitchen back to the uh, formal dining area. Speaking of the kitchen, we're now going to take a look at it. We have the nice gas stove, gas oven, a microwave, some nice counter space to the right of that, and then some additional counter space over here in front of us with the kitchen, dishwasher, and refrigerator, all stainless steel finishes. All the appliances you see are included with the rental of this property. Want to take a look at the attached one car garage. We do have a washer dryer in here. We do have some storage spaces as well. So it's nice to have that. Uh, you know, people tend to have a lot of items and they want to keep some of them outside. So it's great to have that functionality of this garage with the washer and dryer out there and some storage space at this property. Again, kind of pointing out this pass through area for the breakfast bar. We've got some additional storage space right above that, as you can see there, hang some pots and pans, or maybe just some uh, decorative items. Again, a good amount of cabinet space in this kitchen, which is great, and a good amount of counter space. All right, let's continue the tour. We're gonna go take a look at the first of two bathrooms. This bathroom would serve the um, main living areas as well as two of the bedrooms. Uh, the master bathroom, the master bedroom does have its own attached master bath, which we'll take a look at shortly. So again, Again, nice shower over tub, tiled finish. Uh, we have a vanity right over there, and we have the toilet as well. And you've got a cool stained glass um, uh, area right above the uh, shower and tub, which is nice to let in some unique character and some unique light uh, as you are going about getting ready in the bathroom. We've got a linen closet right over here to our left. We always like to open those doors and show you what uh, kind of closet space is available. And to our right, we have an additional uh, closet space, which is great because you can never have too many closets. It's something that people quickly realize when they move into a property. All right, as I mentioned, we have three bedrooms, two bathrooms. So we have two of the bedrooms right here. We're gonna start over here on our right. Uh, this is going to be the first bedroom looking out into the backyard. Again, dimensions will be on the website. That's go5starpm.com. Again, go5starpm.com. We've got uh, high quality photographs. Again, link to the online application, qualification criteria. Anything else you might want to know about this property is going to be located there. Again, you've got the nice uh, inlaid wood floors in this room, so it really lets the light bounce around. Fresh paint in here, fresh blinds. Um, it's a good size room, and again, the dimensions are on the website, so definitely take a look at that when you get the opportunity. We will also take a peek here um, at the next space as we move through this property. Let's go take a look now at the second bedroom right across the hall. Again, this may be, you know, maybe you're working from home a few days a week, so you want to use one of these areas as like a, as a temporary office or maybe a game room or anything along the lines that you can see fit. Um, it's just nice to have multiple bedrooms and those options uh, here at this property in San Bruno. So again, this is the second bedroom. Again, nice window looking out to the side yard, new blinds, the, um, highly polished wood floor, inlaid wood floor continues in this room as well, as well as the crown molding and the nice trim as well. So we've got a closet there too. So we're just kind of doing our best to give you a nice overview of this room. If there is anything that you feel we missed, always feel free to reach out. We're happy to answer any questions, but um, again, we do our best to give you as much detail as possible about these properties. So I just wanted to show you the closet space. There is a closet rod and there's a shelf above that. So you've got some really good usable space there in that closet for this room. All right, we're gonna continue the tour now. We're gonna head to the back of the house, which has the master bedroom and the attached master bathroom. It's nice because it is at the back of the house. You've got additional privacy, um, a little bit more quiet. And it's just, again, you've got some separation between all of the rooms and from the main living area. So maybe if you have guests over or, or uh, you've got multiple family members, you all kind of have your space to go and, and you know, 
move around and have some privacy. All right, that was a door that, w that we were showing you there. That goes up the backyard. We will go take a look at that um, after we tour this back bedroom. So again, this is the back bedroom, master bedroom. We've got a lot of natural light in this room, as you can see here, because we've got these nice high-mounted windows. We have another window there facing out in the backyard. Nice new blinds. Very tall ceiling, too, with recessed ceiling lights, so that's great for the evening time uh, to let in some you know, keep the light flow constant. Very nice light fixture there as you enter through the um, main door as well. And there's a fan up there. I don't know if you saw that, but there is a fan in this room as well. There's a closet space right there. And then we're gonna also take a look at the attached master bath. So again, this is a really nice room, um, very cozy, very comfortable. And it is nice because it is at the back of the property, kind of away from the hustle and bustle of the rest of the house. All right, let's go take a look at the attached master bathroom. Very nicely redone, nice vanity, very nice light fixture above the vanity. Super, super nice shower with that inlaid stone floor there and the stone uh, continues up the wall there. It's kind of an accent, nice glass door and you do have a window in here as well. So very nicely finished, refinished bathroom. That's always something we like to see at these properties. You can tell the owner spent a lot of time, money, energy, and effort taking care of this property and it shows. And uh, we believe that the lucky resident that calls this place home will also be very happy with that. Okay, we're gonna go take a look now at the backyard. Uh, one feature I wanted to point out was the built-in um, shades inside of that glass which is a kind of a cool feature so you don't have to worry about them getting dusty or dirty they're they're encased within the glass so it's kind of a nice feature the backyard one little note we are still under construction back here so it's not going to be in its final form quite yet but we just wanted to give you a sneak peek of it so you can see what you have available to work with back here it's a nice size backyard easy to manage you've got a nice concrete area over here so if you wanted to set out like a propane gas um, stove to barbecue you can easily do that have you know some nice times out here with friends or family doing some barbecuing or just hanging out maybe even setting up a little table and chairs to kind of get some remote work done outside in the fresh air um, just to kind of get some you know something a change of scenery from being inside all day so that's going to kind of wrap up our tour we're going to head back into the property here just to kind of make our way back through the front door but we really want to do our best to kind of just show you a nice overview of the property. I think when you look at pictures online, it doesn't always really explain the layout or the flow or just the overall vibe of it. So by doing these videos, we really the feedback has been that people really appreciate them. It really allows them to decide up front whether or not this is something they want to pursue. So we really like doing these videos, and we're going to continue to do that, and we always appreciate your feedback on them. Again, that's the master bathroom, master bedroom as well back there. The additional two bedrooms are going to be located over here to our right and to our left and we'll just kind of show you those again just to kind of give you a frame of reference so again uh, one of the uh, three bedrooms again located over here the other one is going to be located over to our left and then um, we're just showing you that real quick here showing you the third bedroom over here to our left and then um, in front of us here we've got some additional closets and then the bathroom which services the main living area and these two bedrooms and the kitchen to our right so really that's going to kind of wrap up our tour um, you know, we know it was kind of a brief tour, but again, we want to give you as much detail in a short amount of time as possible. If there's anything we missed, feel free to reach out. If not, we plan to see you at one of the upcoming open houses. So take care, and we will talk to you soon. Thanks for watching.